hey guys so i'm back with another video and i'm going to do like a reveal video so i filmed this video yesterday and i looked a mess and you know what i'm okay with that lessons learned the lesson that is going to be learned is that i can't be doing videos where i don't have myself put together i don't have makeup on and all of that with the lighting i look i look a mess and i'm not even so i have been wanting a new pair of sunglasses because i was on a trip um, I went to Miami, I had got, I was on a jet ski, the jet ski flipped over and I lost my Celine ZZ Top sunglasses in the water. And to be honest with you, which when I said this to people, they were like, oh, you know, because that's a horrible thing to happen when you lose, you know, sunglasses that are like $500 sunglasses. But you don't even be mad. I'm going to tell you why I wasn't even mad. I cannot swim and that was such a traumatic thing. I was like, fuck them sunglasses. I don't. If, like, if that was the cost I had to pay, you know, cool, you know. So, anyway, <laughs> um, I wanted these other Celine sunglasses, but they were, like, on back order, and they wasn't going to come forever. So, I just got these glasses because I wanted these glasses for a minute. I first saw them on Bernice Burgos. They look so cute on her. And Beyonce has these, too, but Beyonce does not have this colorway. Um, so, without any further ado, here is the box or the case. They are Gucci. Gucci, I like your packaging. Celine, y'all need to step y'all packaging up. But it's a hard case. It's velvet. The case is ginormous, but the sunglasses are pretty big. So the plastic's already been taken off of them. Um, this is the Gucci uh, dust cloth that comes with it. And they give me this like satin cloth as well. And on the inside of the box of the case, you see it says Gucci. And the pink I'm gonna get like a less expensive pair. And then I was like, Kelly, these are the glasses that you want. You work hard. You have been doing reward yourself. What would I tell you guys? Treat yourself. So here are the sunglasses. And yes, I could have got another, I sh probably should have gotten a black pair of sunglasses. Because these have a lot of different colors in them and they're probably less wearable, but I don't care. I don't care. I wear black bags. I have a red bag. These are the sunglasses that will be wear worn with them and so be it. But here they are. Let me get a little closer so you can see. And I bought this green wig to wear with the sunglasses. But the wig is like a little more teal than it is green. But that's cool. Whatever. I like the gradient effect of them. And I just think they're the bee's knees. I love the glitter. I like everything about them. So, you know what? We're going to keep them on for the rest of the video. Um, Yeah, so there you go. And if you are interested in the sunglasses, they are Gucci. I'm pretty sure. I think, yeah, okay. Well, you can purchase them from Gucci and you can purchase them from Saks. I will link both. Um... Links in the description bar. However, I suggest purchasing them from Sex so you can get Ebates. And I will link my referral Ebates code because if you don't know what Ebates is, you need to get hit. All right. Oh, I'm getting all my love posts. My girlfriend, I actually got a care package from my girlfriend Tao in Seattle. Um, she sent me a lot of other goodies. But like I said, I filmed this video already before and the stuff that I showed that she filmed. It was in that video and then I put the stuff away so I don't have it. But she also, she's really into sunglasses and she gave me a pair of sunglasses too. And they, this is the case. They're Quay, no, Key Australia. I always say Quay, but it's really Key. And they're these pink sunglasses and I love pink, they're pink mirrored. And I don't know the name of these. If I can find the name, I will link them. But I have another pair of Key Australia sunglasses. They're white. And I like those too. I keep those in my car. I have a white car. But how cool are these? These are so fun. I love pink. So I cannot wait to wear. I can't wait to wear both pair actually. But I'm going to put these back on because time for the Gucci ah, reveal. So I ordered this item from Saks. I should have did gift wrapping. I didn't. I was stupid. But I don't know if I'm going to keep it, you guys. 
and I'll tell you why in a second. So the dust bag is very thin, like very thin dust bag. And I'm really disappointed in the dust bag. Like you guys could step it up. And I've bought another Gucci bag, my uh, Gucci Marmont, but I, that I had since sold. That bag was like a nice dust bag. And maybe because Gucci Marmont is more expensive. I don't know, but that's not right. And I have my receipt in here. I purchased it from Saks. So this is the bag. It's the Gucci Soho Disco Bag. And this is why I'm like on the fence about this bag. This bag is $9.80, you guys. And I just feel like, because I bought the Marmont and then I sold that because I felt like the Gucci Marmont was too trendy. And I try to stay away from like really trendy stuff because I just try to stay away from it. And everybody's like all you know up everybody's all up gucci but right now anyway which that's cool whatever but with the gucci marmont it's even to another level so i was like i like it i like the price point but are you gonna be how are you gonna feel about this bag in 10 years like that's how i think so i got rid of that the Gucci Soho Disco Bag, I feel like it's like a classic Gucci piece. Because Gucci's been around for uh, as long as I can, you know, Gucci been popping. But now it's like on another level with the celebrities and the whole bit. Which they're hitting that out of the park. I'm not mad at them. But this is the bag. It's not so big. I needed like a casual bag to wear and I had to have emerald. I had to have the emerald color because I wanted a color bag. I did not want red because I have a red um, boy bag and I did not want black because I have um, I have a black Chanel bag and I just was like, you need color. Cause also y'all saw I got a, a gray bag too, my uh, YSL bag. So I was like, get the green. I love the green. But with the tax and everything, let me see how much this bag comes up to with the tax and everything. Which I'm digging it with the sunglasses. What? Y'all can't tell me shit. But with the tax. Oh, wait. It doesn't have the tax on here. Because this is the, um, this is a packing slip. It was like $1,000. Okay. It was like $1,008 or whatever. Because $980 plus 5%. Um, actually, I think our tax is 6% Maryland tax. I was like, whoa, because you can get this bag pre-owned for like, let me not be, let me not exaggerate. Maybe like 750, 850 range, which I remember when this bag was eight something, like maybe, well, maybe it was a couple years ago, but I felt like that was a fair price point. And I think it still should be 850. I don't think this is a nine, a nine, a $980 bag. I just don't. Like the hardware is gold hardware, it's, but it's almost like a goldish silver hardware. I do like it. I like the size of it. I feel like I could be able to, I can fit a lot of stuff in here, but I'm not feeling that price point, you guys. And I would wait to like, if I felt like I could get it pre-owned in this color, then I would wait. But I don't feel like I can get it pre-owned in this color. And I really, really want a green bag. So I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna think about it for a little bit. And I'll check my pre-owned sites to see maybe I will be appeased with a different colorway, like a taupe or um a tan or something, because I do need a not tan, what am I saying? Beige. I do need a beige bag. But in my head, I feel like I need a less a more dressier beige bag but I do like it I don't know I don't know I would say tell me what you guys think about the price but you no one's gonna say anything to make me think otherwise so you don't even have to waste your <laughs> time saying like oh I agree or I don't agree because I just I feel strongly about this but sometimes I'm like, you know what? Yeah, you could say it's not worth it, but it is worth it because that's how much it costs and that's how much people buy them for. And this is not 2015 or 2014. This is 2017. The price, the price of stuff goes up. Kelly, what are you going to do about it? But anyway, um, hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Um, I don't know if I mentioned my shirt. Maybe I did. I can't remember. But if you're interested in my shirt, 
Um, I will link it in the description bar before because description bar below because I'm not sure. But I'll see you guys later. Bye.